What is up guys? Welcome back to a new video man. Today I got the biggest unboxing I've ever did in my channel. I never unboxed like five shoes at the same time and I got some heat big ups. You know I hit send and I was like yo everybody's getting gifts and he actually came through. Oh, oh, oh. First of all, everybody celebrating Christmas out there. Merry, Merry Christmas. I hope you had a great weekend. We're having a great weekend spending it with your loved ones. I don't celebrate Christmas myself, but you know what? I was like, everybody getting gifts and shit. Let me buy myself some gifts. Or, I'm sorry, my bad. Santa got me some gifts. Um, my bad. So, as always in the comments, guys, let me know what you think about the pickups. Let me know which one is your favorite. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. I really appreciate you guys. Let's waste no time and go straight up to this video. First shoe, we're gonna start with something light. From a box, you ready to see? <laughs> love you, <laughs> love you forever. I know, I know. In the comments, save the comments, guys. Okay, I already can see the comments. I already can feel the comments. Please save the comments. We got the Drake Air Force over here. The reason why I picked him up. Funny stories. I never actually bought all white Air Force. I bought once in my life, and I just hydro dipped them straight away. So I never had all white Air Forces. And with this one, I was like, you know what? They're going for on retail and first of all shout out to the guy from Vinted. I met up with him and he had a great great price and plus he's gonna upload some steals on his Vinted soon uh, or like in the next few months. So if you have Vinted you can follow him. He's, he's fair with his prices. Amazing guy man. Shout out to him. But yeah the reason why I picked him up first of all the price was really like around retail. Um, the details on them are crazy. The quality on the leather is amazing and we got Love You Forever on here on the midsole. Usually you have the air like this on the inside, you know, usually have it also on the outside. We got the Nocta Nosa, whatever you want to call it, um, logo on the back, which is also a nice add to the shoe. And we get those letters and numbers, you can you can put them on the laces here and write something like, I always take L's or like, I bait resale, you can do that if you want to. We get the extra laces with the metal tips. And we get the special, we get the special insole, baby blue, uh, it's like a Nocta color I would say. The other side, pretty much the same, other than the back, we have the Nike Air here, we don't have the branding, Nocta branding. Insole is the same, blue, with a, a Nocta logo on there, and Nike swoosh. Um, again, quality on these are madness. And we got one more detail that I forgot about, we got the heart shapes, and the, like, look at this. Instead of the dots or the points we used to have, or the circles, we're gonna call them, we got... Yeah, we got some heart shaped, um, I don't know what to call them, but we, these are the things on the bottom are heart shaped. And this was one of the reasons they they wanted to cancel the shoe actually, because it was hard to produce I guess. And yeah, the top box is also a little bit different. Look at this. Um, but yeah, this is my first pickup. I don't want to talk for much guys, I'm sorry for talking so much. But this is my first pickup guys, on feet as you can see. Pretty clean shoe, you know, you can go on with that quality and I believe they're gonna go up just because it's a Drake collab and the small details in there, the quality and all of that stuff, I do believe it's gonna go up. Second backup, I already full, did a full review on this shoe. It was not my size, sadly, back in the day. It wasn't my personal pair, but now I found them. They were lost. Santa found them, brought them to me, man. We get the lost and founds. This is one of the top shoes this year for sure. We got, again, if you wanna watch the full review, you can check it out. I'm just gonna talk quickly about them. Um, yeah, we got the special detail, special wrapping paper, the receipt, special receipt, and the shoes, man. Pretty amazing shoe, amazing quality. I love it. My bear has no flaws. Got, um, thank God, no flaws, anything on the bear. Amazing, amazing shoe, man. Again, if you want to watch the full review, I'll leave it up here. You can go check it out. Okay, so let's talk about resale on them. They are starting to go up slowly, as I expected. They're going to go up in the next few months. They're going to go up like crazy, so... If you want a bear, make sure to be quick, grab your bear because it's gonna go up and you don't wanna miss it. The details and everything about this shoe is amazing. It's a must have for each sneaker collector. Okay, this next pair is is interesting, man, because you don't know that I got it. I didn't boss about it yet. I had it like for a week now. I didn't wear it yet. But this is also gonna be on the top, on the top, top, top of this year's top 10 list. It's gonna, it's gonna be out there, man. Um, and a lot of people actually been hating on it. I don't know why. I really do like it. I like it. I, and I saw it on feet. I was like, you know what? I had to get it. Talking about Desiring Williamson, Voodoo, uh, Air Force, Air Force, bro. Air Jordan ones. The reason why I love this shoe, first of all, because it goes crazy. The colors are crazy on them. 
We get the crazy details such as the skull on the on the back with the with a button eye going out of the shoe. It's legit like they had they have a button on there and the flipped Air Jordan Wings logo on the back, the flipped Nike Air tag on the tongue and the whole cutaway man. The whole cutaway is a vibe special insole. We got this special sale laces whatever you want to call them. Remind me of the Travis Dunks. Also another thing you're going to notice is oh, come on man. That they have two different toe boxes. Look, one is brown and one is green. Amazing, amazing. This shoe is amazing. Quality on them, top tier. Quality is top tier. Um, not only the toe box is different, like the whole, you see, like you get two different mismatched shoes, which is, if you ask me, amazing. You got the top box special as well. It's a must have for me, and the price that I got it for was actually not bad. And I was like, you know what? It was hard to find, like for real. Like I was looking for my for my size for a while, and I'm glad that I found it for a good price because I do believe this is gonna go up as well. It's Zion Williamson. He's gonna be a top star in the next few years. He's gonna dominate the league. My eyes is gonna be one of the best to ever do it. Um, that's why this is his first Jordan One collab, and it's an amazing one. So. If this had Travis name on it, these will be much, much higher because it has also Travis vibe for me with all the, those crazy details, flipped swooshes and s small stuff on there. They do have a Travis vibe. Um, but yeah, if they had the Travis name on there, this shoe will be much, much more than that. Than they're going there now, but I'm telling you, they're slowly going up. So you better grab a bear right now. So moving on, we got a bear that she's also ready. As you can see from the Nike SP box, we got the eBay dunks that I got also last week. I already wore them to work on Christmas day because I feel like it was a good Christmas shoe with the Christmas socks. But this is also a nice shoe. They are uncomfortable. I could confirm that now that they are uncomfortable. Some people say they are uncomfortable and I can confirm that right now. Around the toe box, they just mad tight. Like when you wear them at first, they, they feel fine. But after a few hours of wear, they just too tight, man. Um, it's not bad, bad, but you get a, like, if you're planning on wearing it for a few hours, don't do that um, because it's gonna hurt your foot. Um, it did hurt a little bit, but I survived. But this is also a shoe that I picked up. Amazing shoe, crazy details on it. Uh, you don't see this every day. Great story also behind it. That's why I had to pick it up and it's staying in the collection. I already wore them as well, so stay in the collection for sure. So, moving on, we got probably the heaviest shoe in this collection, man. Pick up from this week. Travis's man, Travis, 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 what you doing to my bank account, man? What, what you doing to my bank account, man? I can't keep doing that. For review is on as well with the with the t-shirt and jacket. If you wanna check it out, I'll leave it as well over there. You can check it out. But real quick again, let's talk about the Travis's and the crazy packaging and the crazy details. And I've heard a lot of people talking about the quality being bad on their bear. Mine, thank God. It's just good, like very good. I have no problems with like glue stains. A little bit of glue stains is there, just normal, but like no scratches or anything. My bear is actually really good and I love those thick laces. They look good on him. Uh, if you wanna watch um, the full review again, you can check it out. Amazing bear, they went down with price like 300 euros cheaper in the last week, um, which is mad, but we expected that. I, saw, I said that on my stream. I said that it would be around 600, 550, 600 is the price you're looking at. People said, nah, they're just gonna stay about 800. People said it might go lower. For me, I, th I thought like 550, 650 is the price range you're gonna look at because the first is all black shoe and they go down at the beginning. But I do believe in the future, these will hold value and they're gonna go up like crazy just because we saw the black cats, we saw the other black shoes, you know? And these will be the same. These will do numbers in the future, especially with the also extra details like the B on the back and the Travis details, the swoosh and all. This is an amazing shoe that I'm gonna wear as well, soon, really soon. But yeah guys, these are my big ups from last week. I'd say Christmas big ups, even though I don't celebrate Christmas, but just because it's Christmas time, let's call them Christmas big ups. Yeah, let me know what you got. Let me know if you got any crazy big ups or any any big ups uh, last week. Let me know in the comments. Or you got any Christmas sneaker gifts, let me know down in the comments, guys. Appreciate you for watching. If you made it this far, you're a real one. I love you. I really do appreciate you all. Again, have a blessed weekend. Spend it with your loved ones. Don't waste your time on some bullshit, man. Do something with your life. I love you guys. Take care. Until next time. Peace out. Bro, I can't, I can't believe I did that shit, right? <laughs>